Monday, the 14th of October, 2024. First reading. Reading from the book of Galatians. The law says, if you remember, that Abraham had two sons, one by the slave girl and one by his free-born wife. The child of the slave girl was born in the ordinary way. The child of the free woman was born as the result of a promise. This can be regarded as an allegory. The women stand for the two covenants. The first who comes from Mount Sinai and whose children are slaves is Hagar. The Jerusalem above, however, is free and is our mother, since scripture says, shout for joy, you barren women who bore no children, break into shouts of joy and gladness, you who were never in labor. For there are more sons of the forsaken one than sons of the wedded wife. So, my brothers, we are the children, not of the slave girl, but of the free-born wife. When Christ freed us, he meant us to remain free. Stand firm, therefore, and do not submit again to the yoke of slavery. Responsorial Psalm May the name of the Lord be blessed forevermore. Praise, O servants of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. May the name of the Lord be blessed, both now and forevermore. May the name of the Lord be blessed forevermore, from the rising of the sun to its setting. Praise be the name of the Lord. High above all nations is the Lord. Above the heavens his glory. May the name of the Lord be blessed forevermore, who is like the Lord, our God, who has risen on high to his throne, yet stoops from the heights to look down, to look down upon heaven and earth. From the dust he lifts up the lowly. From the dung heap he raises the poor. May the name of the Lord be blessed forevermore. Gospel Acclamation Alleluia! Alleluia! Because of your love, give me life, and I will do your will. Alleluia! Gospel. Reading from the book of Luke. The crowds got even bigger, and Jesus addressed them. This is a wicked generation. It is asking for a sign. The only sign it will be given is the sign of Jonah. For just as Jonah became a sign to the Ninevites, so will the Son of Man be to this generation. On Judgment Day, the Queen of the South will rise up with the men of this generation and condemn them, because she came from the ends of the earth to hear the wisdom of Solomon, and there is something greater than Solomon here. On Judgment Day, the men of Nineveh will stand up with this generation and condemn it, because when Jonah preached they repented, and there is something greater than Jonah here. Gospel of the Lord